right. We're on your side now with a scam warning tonight. The Perquimans County Sheriff says someone is hacking computers with a virus just to take your money to fix it. And even then, you're not getting the fix you're promised, creating a vicious, costly cycle. New at 5, 10 on your side's Deanna Betaneshi has what you need to know to protect yourself. Deanna? Well, this is really an in-depth scam, and the scammers don't just contact the victim once, but over and over again. The sheriff of Perquimans County has a warning for residents to be careful of online scammers. Someone in the county was a recent victim. So they received the email. Uh, once they got the email, they opened it up. When it opened up, it popped up a virus onto their screen. Um, call this number, we'll help you get rid of the virus. Sheriff Shelby White tells me this is just the beginning of the scam. Well, they actually told them that they're, by the virus being entered into, that it was a um, financial hacker that got into their system and gotten their financial information and telling them then to move the money from their accounts that it was in into a dummy account so that they can use that dummy account to catch the hacker. Sheriff White says the scammers then tell the victim to take the money out in small amounts so it's not suspicious. Pretty much everything was being put on gift cards and then they would contact, they would tell them the numbers on the gift cards and they would draw the money off of them. Sheriff White says the scammers continued the scam over a more than two week period. He says it can be difficult to catch these kinds of scammers. This one here, we're actually gonna get the feds involved. Um, get the FBI involved and see if they can help us to be able to track it because we know it's not going to be anything local. He says if someone's telling you to put money on a gift card, many times it's a scam. If there's ever any question on them, do not hesitate to contact us, call us. We can tell you if it is a scam or not. The sheriff says if any other residents have dealt with this or something similar, to give the sheriff's office a call. Deanna Betaneshi, 10 on your side.